They're calling this Snowmageddon. I guess like it's like the worst snowstorm in like 25, 50 years, guys, in Washington State. So I'm actually kind of sketched out of driving in a snowstorm, you know? And then driving this, it's gonna be worse when I get in my Hyundai, so. I gotta hurry, get, get to the shop and my stuff in the car and just go and hopefully don't have any problems. Yeah. We're on the Narrows Bridge. Look at this crazy. Holy cow, you can't see nothing. Somebody lost their bumper. Can we get that license plate? <laughs> What's up? I am stressing out right now. Um, I guess they're calling for like the biggest storm in like history, like in the last 25 to 50 years, like the biggest storm that Washington State has ever had. <sighs> I don't have any groceries at home. I have a little bit of money, and I guess like everybody's saying, and they're saying on the radios that all the stores are like bought out and the shelves are empty and shit. And Fuck, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Um, I'm going to do a job right now. I'm working right now. Um, on the way to the job, I'm gonna stop at like this Albertsons and just see if like I can get some fucking stock up on some chili and some fucking cases of water real quick um, on the way to my job. So that's what I'm thinking I gotta do. I hope they have at least have chili and water because fuck, I don't know what I'm gonna do, what I'm gonna eat if I don't don't have that. What do I get, you know? What am I gonna eat? <sighs> Alright, so check it. I went into a Safeway. Not an Albertsons. I found a Safeway. I'd prefer Safeway, so. Anyway, I went into the Safeway and freaking, uh, the shelves were pretty much full. Like, I don't know what everybody was talking about on the radio. Maybe it's in certain areas where people just, like, went crazy, but that Safeway was full. I'm thinking it's probably the bigger stores, like Walmart. People are just fucking raiding those bigger stores. The ones that are cheaper. Because Walmart and Winco and Costco, those are, like, cheaper than Safeway. So probably people raided the hell out of those. But, uh, yeah, Safeway's shelves were nice and full. So I'm good with that. That works. So I got $40 worth of stuff. Uh, pretty much just grabbed, like, <laughs> they had a deal on cereal, like honey bunches of oats uh, with strawberries. I bought three of those. I got a gallon of milk, some hot dogs, and um, like four or five, I think it was like four, no, four cans of chili, a couple cans of like some kind of soup. It was like chowder, a couple cans of chowder. Um, fuck, what else? I got some like cookies or something for, for goodies, you know, but... That's, that's about it. That's all I got. I think it'll get me by, you know. It should, should help me survive a week, I think. I don't know. Maybe. Barely. <laughs> Fuck. They're calling for, like, the biggest freaking storm in, like, history in the last 50 years or whatever. There's already, already like, flurries, like, in the air and stuff. So, I don't know, man. It's gonna be interesting. I'm gonna see what happens. I, I really hope that we don't, like, lose power or something, because I feel like that's going to be a thing. I really hope not. I hope we keep our power no matter what. Anyway, um, I was, I got done with the groceries. I didn't take much little time in there, because I'm on company time, so I just, I hurried, you know. Just, you know, be safe. The boss said it was okay as long as I was, it was on the way and I was quick about it, you know, so... I went as fast as I could, and then when I got out of the parking lot, my damn truck um, fuel light, says low fuel, kept flashing at me and dinging at me. I'm like, oh, shit. So I uh, went back went back to my uh, my base, basically, and uh, fueled up. It took only 12 gallons. This truck holds like 20-something, I think. So I don't know. There's something wrong with the fuel gauge. I told him to uh, put in a work order have our, our mechanics uh, fix it because yeah, it's getting annoying there's so many times where I think I'm out of gas and I go to fuel it and it's like it's already full or you know so we don't ever know and I was just coming back to fuel up just to be on the safe side because I don't want to be like running out of gas in a snowstorm that is not my idea of fun fuck so yeah the, the guy uh, that had it last I guess he didn't feel it and then we have a guy that goes around and feels the trucks but 
nobody filled it. I don't know. It took 12 gallons, so obviously nobody filled it up. Uh, but it wasn't wasn't that close to empty, as close as it said. But you know, at least you know, gotta be on the safe side. Shit. Anyways, guys, I'm heading to my job. I hope I don't get snowed out. I got a whole bunch of septic uh, tank risers to install. I have four of them. Uh, hopefully, I can get it all done before I get snowed out. That's the plan, because this might be my last day at work anywhere for like a week, because if they're if, if they're legit on how crazy the snowstorm's going to be, I won't be able to do Uber either. I'll be stuck at home, so pretty pretty worried about paying bills now guys damn fuck <laughs> gotta promote them pr promote my affiliate links and hope for some donations in the streams because damn i don't know man i will be broke as fuck i will have like overdraft fees i can't pay my bills oh my god damn and you know i can't keep borrowing money from my mom so i don't know what i'm gonna do fuck life is crazy man if it wasn't for all the damn speeding tickets and, uh, you know, paying to get my license back, I was like $400. I'd probably be sitting just fine right now. But no, I had to pay them all that damn money. Fuck. Alright, here it is, guys. 12.15 on Friday, and it is starting to come down. Look at them snowflakes. I'm in Gig Harbor. Half hour later, look, it's really coming down, guys. Damn, I to get out of here. All right, we finished. We installed four risers. Two 12-inch uh, little ones and two 24-inch big ones. And a customer said they'd just leave the lids here. Access dirt over here, so makes it easier. Let me get out of here. It's snowing pretty good. Look at this guys, it's like a little more than an hour later. Wow. That's just crazy. <laughs> Only been snowing for like an hour. So I'm actually kind of sketched out of uh, fucking driving in a snowstorm, you know. And I got an hour to drive to my work and then like an hour at least home. Probably an hour and a half because of traffic slowdown. Uh, I don't know how well my Honda is gonna drive in this shit. It's gonna be worse when I get in my Honda, so I gotta hurry, get get to the shop and freaking get my stuff in the car and just go and hopefully don't have any problems. Never had to drive in a snowstorm before. It's just crazy. I mean, it kind of like nothing this crazy though. Like I don't know. I don't know. I think this is gonna be the craziest shit I've ever driven in for sure. Uh, it's getting worse and worse and worse, so fuck. Almost to the point where I can't even, like, see so much snow. All you see is just white coming at you. <laughs> fuck. Getting on the freeway in Gig Harbor on the other side, you can see the traffic's all backed up. It's pretty nuts. Yeah. You're on the Narrows Bridge. Look at this shit, it's crazy. Holy cow, you can't see nothing. Look at this, guys. By Sprague Avenue. Coma. Snowing like a mother. Was just stuck in traffic, not anymore. Thank God. I don't know, it's probably gonna slow up up here too. Minutes later and I'm about to Tacoma Dome now. <laughs> it's fucking crazy. Stop and go. Somebody lost their bumper. Can we get that license plate? <laughs> what the fuck? Damn. On Tacoma, check it out. A little snow on the ground. <laughs> Those are some really big flakes too. Look how big those flakes are. Got white it is out there. <laughs> GPS took me on a different road. It's not as nice as the one I was on. Me and this truck in front of me have been spinning, spinning tires, man. Shit is crazy. What's up, guys? What's going on? I just got off work. I am in my car, my little Honda. I'm gonna try to drive an uh, hour and 15 commute home in this freaking crazy snowstorm. Um, hopefully it's an okay drive and uh, hopefully we don't have any issues right it's kind of crazy and dangerous out here so I'm trying to get home safe and sound that is the plan hey guys I am heading home almost home 
Roads aren't so bad right now. Uh, this is one of the roads I thought was going to be horrible. It's not too bad. I can live with this. Um, chances are, guys, um, I'm going to get snowed in in my house. That's going to be crazy. They're calling this Snowmageddon, or whatever the fuck they're calling it. Um, I guess like it's like the worst snowstorm in like 25, 50 years, guys, in Washington State. So that's what they're saying. That's what's going to happen. Um, I've got a little bit of food. Hopefully it's enough. And I got two cases of water. So I think that'll be enough. But yeah, I'm going to be I'm gonna be stuck at home. I'm really hoping that the power holds up. Um, you know. Because like if I don't... If I lose power, then I can't live stream. I can't watch YouTube. I can't do nothing. It's like I can vlog but I wouldn't be able to edit or upload it. <laughs> That's it. You know, because I can charge my phone with my car. I, I will do that. I'll run my car and charge my phone just to vlog uh, if, I, if I have to. But I really hope not. I really hope that we just keep our power. Fingers crossed. But yeah, this is supposed to be the worst storm 25, 50 years, guys. So, wow. All right. <laughs> Here it comes. I'm gonna stay my ass inside. I got enough propane to heat the house. I got enough propane for cooking and all that good stuff. So, um, you know, I think I will survive and probably won't be going to work for a while. Uh, one of the guys at work says, uh, if it's as bad as everybody's talking, um, he says, uh, we might not see you till like the following fucking Monday. Like, not, not this coming Monday, but the following after that. And I'm like, oh, shit, man. Like, I gotta work, though. I gotta pay them bills. And I can't be out here driving Lyft or Uber either, because these roads are gonna be very dangerous. Right now, it's, like, all borderline dangerous. Like, it's getting worse as I get to my house now, I'm, I'm noticing. So, fuck. It's crazy. Anyway, I'm almost home. I'm literally five minutes from home, so... I survived the drive home, guys. Uh, it was a little sketch, but, you know, we made it. And all is good. Hell yeah. Uh, guys, check it out. Looks like somebody was doing some donuts here. <laughs> it's funny. It's like something I'd do in high school. Anyway, this is the driveway. See how crazy my driveway is. Sure, not very many people have been driving on this, so yeah, it's gonna be worse than the roads. Oh, I gotta check my mail. Actually, a little breezy out here. There's the driveway. It's snowing pretty good now. I'll get my butt inside. So look at the top of our roof here. It's been snowing for a little more than four hours. Kind of like off and on. Pretty crazy. I'm supposed to do this for I think at least two or three days straight. I don't know. It's gonna be crazy. Fuck. Alright guys, I'm gonna go ahead and unload all my groceries and all that good stuff and get out of my work outfit, crank up the freaking heat in the house, and uh, we're gonna be doing some chilling. Hey, I appreciate you guys showing all that support on the video on the MBRS Commander channel, the the support a creator, uh, uh, Fortnite, uh, can't even remember, cuddle something event. <laughs> anyway, yeah, I just uh, decided to jump on that event because Fortnite's paying, or Epic Games is paying four times the amount of money, and I needed to promote that to make some money, so, you know. Um, it, like, totally is blowing up. And it's all because you guys uh, watched it, like, you know, watched it all the way through. You guys put a lot of time watching it, and you, you liked it, and you left comments, and that just, like, boosted the video, like, hella. 
So I appreciate you guys when you do that, you know. For any video you do that, man, I, I appreciate it so much. You have no idea. You know, because when I'm successful at this YouTube thing, I am not going to forget about you. I'm going to take you up with me to the top. That's the plan, y'all. Alright, guys. Smash that like, subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you on the next one. Peace.